Hallelujah. God didn't call Preacher Warren to be a pimp. Mm -hmm. We have enough pimps in the church already. Mm -hmm. Some of you going to church on a Sunday morning, still smoking and drinking and cussing. After you done left the church, you still cussing. Mm -hmm. Drinking moonshine. Drinking beer. And still getting drunk. And you just came out of church. You reverence in the pulpit. Lusting out the women in the church. Women in the church. Learn to dress holy. That's right. You don't wear a skirt. Way up here. And expect a man not to look. Mm -hmm. And then expect your husband not to get jealous. Mm -hmm. Come on, somebody. That's right. You go to church now. Women got their breasts out. Mm -hmm. Men up there cheating on their wife in the church. Knowing he has a wife. Mm -hmm. God ain't pleasing some of you church folks. That's right. Amen. Thank you. Amen. Thank you. You got more hypocrites in church now than you find outside of church. It's a shame. Mm -hmm. Amen. Somebody know I'm telling the truth. Mm -hmm. Thank you, hypocrite. They don't make no sense, right? That's why I thought the woman church. Thank yes. you. Yes, sir. See, God requires holiness. We know we ain't perfect, but don't make an excuse and say, well, it's okay for me to cheer my wife, I ain't perfect. You know you wrong. Mm -hmm. Don't say, well, I'm not perfect, so I ain't cheating my husband. If you know something is wrong, don't do it. Mm -hmm. God didn't call me to be a pet. If I know a woman is married, I'm not going to make a pass at a married woman. Why? She's married. That's right. You know I'm telling the truth. They, they don't even care you're married now. You know, I don't care if she's married. She's fine. Well, she's fine, but tell yourself, she may be fine, but she's not mine. <laughs> I love Priscilla so much, Miss Mary Dobbins. She's going to be called Lady Adams in the future. I love you so much. It don't matter how many other women that may try to come around. My mind is only on you. Why? Because you're the one that God has put in my life. I gotta carry myself like a man who's already taken. Come on, son. That's right. That's all we are with Jesus. And when you're married with Jesus, you gotta carry yourself in a holy manner. Come on, somebody. I know I'm telling the truth. Because God said, Be holy, for I am holy. If you say you love Jesus, you obey his word. Jesus said, You love me, keep my commandments. He said, Why call me Lord, Lord, and do not the things I say? When you're married, you gotta conduct yourself like a married man and a married woman mm -hmm. on the job. That's right. You don't go on the job and take your wedding ring off and flip around with different girls on the job and know you have a wife. Mm -hmm. If I know a woman is not my wife, I'm not gonna make a pass at a married woman. That's right. She ain't my wife. These days they don't care. They write in the church flipping around. Mm -hmm. The Bible said homeowners. Come on, somebody. God will judge. This is no shot and dancing message. That's right. This is no get ready, get ready, harvest message. Mm hmm Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. God wants us to be holy. He said, be holy, for I am holy. Being a child molester ain't holy. We got all these child molesters of a lot of Catholic churches. Like the little boys. Mm. Preach going to hell until you don't repent. Mm. God ain't got no child molesters up in his church. That's right. God ain't got no sex offenders up in his church. Sex offenders are going to hell. Child molesters are going to hell if you don't repent. Mm -hmm. Come on, somebody. Thank you, Jesus. Devil worshipers are going there. Mm -hmm. Witches are going there. This is no dancing message. That's right. When you love God, you hate sin. Because although God is love, but God hates sin. That's right. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I don't want no money for what I'm doing. Praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. Bible said, Let's go to the book of 1 Corinthians, chapter number 7, when the Bible said, it's better to marry than to burn. Mm -hmm. God ordained marriages to avoid fornication. Let's go to 1 Corinthians. This is good teaching. Man. Amen. Am I talking right, missionary? It's better to marry than to burn, to avoid fornication. What's fornication? Sex before marriage. First Corinthians chapter 6, verse 9 said, Be not deceived, neither fornicators, annihilators, adulterers, I feminine, are not abusers of themselves, will inherit the kingdom of God. So it's avoid sex before marriage. It's better to get married. Mm -hmm. The Bible said marriage is honorable in all, and the bed is on the fire. Yes. So better to marry than the bird. That's right. God didn't call me to be a pet. Too many pips in the church already. Pippin. 
Got a thousand rings looking like Mr. T. Mm -hmm. Got all these gold chains on here with something. <laughs> Acting like he Mac Daddy. Mm -hmm. God ain't called a man. God ain't called a man of God to be a pimp. Yes. You don't go with another man's girlfriend. You yes. go with your wife. You. God ain't called me to be a pimp. He called me to be a man of God. Mm -hmm. A man of God who conduct himself like a man of God and not preach for the money. Thank Come you. on, somebody. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm talking, right? Thank you, Jesus. Bible says, "Better to marry than to burn." Let's go to verse two, First Corinthians chapter seven. Nevertheless, to avoid fornication, let every man have his own wife. Mm -hmm. Instead of the man's wife, have your own wife, mm -hmm. and let every woman have her own husband, not another woman's husband. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jesus. But the first husband is still living, and he got divorced. If you marry that man, that's adultery. Mm -hmm. Have your own wife. Yes, have sir. your own husband. Not go on and marry man, knowing mm -hmm. he's married. If he's having marriage a problem, tell him to get marriage counseling and see Jesus. Can you say amen to somebody? I don't care how fine that woman is. If that's not my wife, I ain't gonna be going with her. Why? My mind is on Priscilla. Mm -hmm. Miss Larry Bell. Miss Larry Priscilla. When you love somebody, you don't cheat on them. That's true. Go to the next part. 